Seven Plus Pro Wrestling League Season Chart, co-powered by Amul Mea Bhakta, Women 62, Yani, Passat Kilogram, Varga Kusti Mukableka, Devyo Sajano, Delhi Sultans Kior Seare, Bharati Mulki, Sakshi. Dabari Chaman Plus Pro Wrestling League Season Chart co powered by Amal Me. My love is Basar Kilogram by Kushti Mukable Me. Stuti Pajada Royals Ki or Seara Hihe. Bharati Mulki Kumari Anita. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for celebration as of now, interim, uh, uh, for uh, Studi Punjab Royals because they have a one bout advantage. Now let's see what happens now in this very bout because this is a women's 62 kilogram uh, category bout. Dilli Sultans has an icon player who stepped in onto the mat. Sunil, we need to understand what do you think? Is this going to be an equalizer? Well, again, you've got the biggest player this country has seen in women's wrestling, Sakshi Malik. Uh, let's see how she uh, faces this. She was blocked in the first part and narrowly won Navjot's bout. Let's see. Well, uh, we have uh, Anita uh, from uh, Stuti Punjab Royals, 2015 National Championship gold medal. In 14 national championship again she had a gold and 2018 national championship silver medal winner so she has basically been only on a national circuit whereas uh, the advantage of uh, sakshi malik is the fact that she has had so much of international exposure and uh, that could work as an advantage for sakshi it but you never know because we have been breaking the norms when it comes to conventional thought because every conventional thought or <laughs> what we have preempted has been broken totally and thrown at our face by pro wrestling league absolutely you've got to live the moment here in fact there's a little backstory when it comes to about anita anita has a, a year and a half old son and she made a comeback after two and a half years and won a gold at the national championships in 19 uh, in 65 kg category brilliance brilliance uh, this is for all the uh, b b household ladies out there who actually actually don't give them that benefit of the ab to bacche ho gaye ab humne kya karna hai you know that's the attitude which conventionally we see in india but that is being changed these are the proud representatives of that you know after you have an offspring Traditionally, it is being thought that way. Now, this is not that I'm being sexist or I'm being racist about a certain species, but what I'm saying is here we see it's an everyday work while they, you have your kids and they're being looked after. I mean, this is like any other office office going lady in the corporate world. In fact, she's a cop. Anju is a cop uh, oh, by, nice. in, in the Haryana police. And when I just met her at the at the uh, at, at the at the auction, she said she wanted to all she wanted to do was dream was to play for any team franchisee at the pro wrestling league and that was her biggest motivator so look at the story here is a woman who's got a son who's a com doing a great job in the in the in the in the police department suddenly decides that she wants to make a comeback how maria stadnik did after her two kids and won the olympic medal uh, let's include another sport mary com being uh, yes. one of those uh, icons and uh, inspiration for all the ladies yes certainly but in wrestling i think this for indians anju is a great poster child for this particular sport 
Yes, of course, aspiration levels are running high in the country these days, thanks to Dawa Chaman Prach Pro Wrestling League's season four co-powered by Amul. This uh, fourth edition has brought in a lot of expectations in terms of conventional fans, and we have a lot of other people who are joining us as well from other sports. I have been getting feedback on my social handles or otherwise people are contacting me and saying that Wrestling is an eye-opener for them, whereas other conventional Indian games were the ones, and there is Sakshi action, Malik action. going for the attack. Anju gone totally defensive. Center. Delhi Sultans have a five-point advantage as of now. Sakshi Malik slowly but surely making the point a difference to make that difference for a winner. End of the first round of this very bout number six. Welcome back after the short break into round number two of bout number six. Women 62 kilogram category competition with Delhi Sultans have Sakshi Malik uh, in this uh, mat uh, area right now with the Stuti Punjab Royals Anita. And Look at here the... it is, another attack. Sakshi Malik is going for the kill. This is the now double leg. To see, is it uh, being converted into points? Because yes. This is the double leg attack Sakshi is known for. She first holds the, the, the hands of her opponent and then suddenly goes into that attack. And there you would see the Arangi, uh, her, her trademark fall. Oh, so it's called Arangi. No finger. Uh, Angrezi, mein, what would we call it? Nothing, right? Trip? Nothing. Leg trip? <laughs> I'm sure so. You trip the person with the leg. Absolutely. Stop. So here we are. Sakshi in full form. Let's see how she does this. Again at nine point lead. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, right now we have a nine-point advantage in favor of Sakshi Malik. Delhi Sultans look comfortable. Looks like they will be able to, as of now, I'm not guaranteeing anything, viewers. As of now, looks like that it could be Sakshi's game, but we still have about two minutes and ten seconds left. Just, uh, we have to see, would it be possible for... Anju to convert that because we've seen over the past few days that just few seconds is enough and you actually get to score eight to maybe uh, nine points in one go in just about a matter of like six maybe seven seconds yes and that's the beauty of the game is that you attack and you keep attacking there's nothing called going back into the position unless the Contact. referee feels so and this is something which Indian wrestlers have to learn from the Russians that they have to come back in the attack now, time after Now, I think that is because when you attack, you look Action. at the spot where you have to grab your... Uh, right. So, if you grab just anyways, Action. because it's a loose uh, weight and it's going every direction. Action. So, it's not like a... Um, a sack of flour, yeah, which is one quintals, and you just pick it up, and it's not responding back to you. Here, where things are happening, Sakshi Malik going for a var attack one more time. I think we see frustration on Anju's face right now. She looks all timid right now, and we have to see: would it be possible? Just under one minute left, 40 seconds of this game. It is very hard for Anju as of now, the way she's been performing, to actually bridge that gap of 11 points. Anita, sorry, uh, viewers. Anita is uh, uh, the name of... The Haryana Sudhi Cop. Punjab uh, Royal... Mrs. Cop. Yes. Yeah. Mother Cop. Uh, yeah. Super mom. Yep. And the wrestler. As of now, last ditch effort, 10 seconds and uh, counting. Uh, Sakshi Malik in uh, full control. It is no going back or looking back for Sakshi Malik. She's just looking at the clock. Last second happened, the bell rings. And now it is again a nail biting finish in this edition. Looks like it's become a norm because Delhi Sultans has actually bridged that gap. Now gets back to the last bout.
That is the brilliance of Pro Wrestling League, ladies and gentlemen. Sunil Yaskalra is going to give us his moments of what he thinks the next bout is all about.